Hey guys, so I wanted to do a grocery haul because I haven't done one in a while. Uh, I came home and changed, and so this is actually an old shirt that I used to wear. If you look at my videos from like 2009, I used to wear this shirt like in public, but now I wear it for like cleaning house and stuff. So I've already changed, um, but you know, I'm just gonna show you guys in this outfit. I would not wear this out in public. Um, anyway, it does show off my collarbones though that are slightly coming out. Anyway, so uh, here we go. Um, Lighthouse Jalapeno Ranch. I've been dipping my carrots in the, well, veggies. It's been carrot, I've been on a carrot kick lately. Um, but I buy this big bottle at a place called Cash and Carry. So it's like a restaurant supply type place. Almost like Costco, but not quite. Um, it's more for like the small business, you know, restaurant or, coffee cart or, you know, little uh, mobile food vendor. So you can buy large quantities at a lower price. So for this, it was on sale for $4.58, I think. Um, I was buying the smaller containers. I think those were $3 and something a piece, and this is over double what that was. So it's a good deal. <clears throat> also at Cash and Carry, I buy my sugar-free syrups. And so the Da Vinci syrups are three dollars and change. I think three forty-eight or something. I don't know. Um, so again, this is cherry. This is my favorite flavor, and I mix this in my Greek yogurt. Um, I also have raspberry, but I just pretty much use the cherry, so I just go with it. These are my favorite carrot chips, and the brand is Grimway Farms. They're the best because they're really thin. I don't know if you can see that in the package, but um, sometimes the carrot chips are really thick and you're like kind of biting down on them. These are nice and thin and crispy and I enjoy them. And then I brought this out. This is how I packaged them in little snack bags. And this brand also lasts a long time. I feel like other brands don't last as long. Now these don't have a lot of liquid in them other brands tend to have like liquid at the bottom and then it's like all wet and ugh. so these are dry but not in a bad way so I love them I can only get them at one store so I specifically go to that store and buy carrots I think this time I bought carrots and rice cakes because the other store was out of rice cakes so that being said rice cakes um, so I use cheap makeup makeup remover wipes to wipe down my CPAP machine at night. Um, you could also do it in the morning, of course, but um, I didn't do that for a long time. I would just like wash it once a week like they want you to, but it always felt like dirty. And so I just wiped them down. I, I looked online, they have specially like designed like CPAP wipes, but come on, it's just your face. So um, yeah but dollar package at the dollar store. So I usually just buy a couple and they last forever. Um, craisins, I do like some craisins. I buy the less sugar and the cherry and then I mix them together and again, put them in those little snack bags. Um, so yeah, sliced peaches in light syrup. Um, this is extra light syrup. I don't know if I've seen any in like water, um, but I drain the syrup anyway. And then I put them in little containers and then I put some cinnamon on top and I like it. Uh, cottage cheese. Again, I put them in my handy dandy little containers that look like this. And I just have a ton of those containers and I buy them at the dollar store and I just bought two more sets because I like them and I like to pre-plan and prepare. Um, so this I didn't buy this week but I've been using so I wanted to share are the sugar-free creamers. Right now I'm on this peppermint mocha. I don't think it tastes like chocolate, but I like that peppermint flavor. And then pumpkin spice, of course. And this is my string cheese bowl that I keep in the fridge. Um, so I just buy packages of string cheese and then put them in here for easy to grab. Um, I have been buying the Sargento, Sargento light string cheese. It's actually a little bit lower in calorie than like the Colby string cheese. They're also a little bit smaller, um, but you know, trying to save where I can. Uh, this is the yogurt I use, Faye 
the zero percent is a little bit sour for me and I even with flavoring I don't like it and then I wouldn't eat it and then it would go bad so I get the two percent and uh, I like it I've been buying the nature's choice or Hormel natural choice no preservatives and it has uh, no nitrates in it no nitrates no artificial ingredients minimally processed raised without added hormones so at um, I shop at two different stores. Winco is where I buy, buy the carrots, and I used to do all my grocery shopping there, but Walmart um, in the, I'm just outside of the main city, um, so there's a small little town a little bit south, and uh, so I've been going to that Walmart, and they sell my yogurt there. In the past, gosh, for the past year, year and a half, I've been making an extra trip to Trader Joe's just to buy yogurt and then to Winco for grocery shopping. Now, I'm still making an extra trip, but it just is working out. Um, so the yogurt I get at Walmart as well as most of the other groceries. And then Walmart has a cheaper price on this natural choice meat um, by $1.50 a package. So I'm not sure why it's so cheap there, but I'm going to go for it. Uh, fiber one you know goes without saying it's really good really low calorie kind of helps me with that crunchy thing and honestly it kind of tastes sweet to me and I think that's because I eat so little sugar I mean there's a little bit of sugar in the craisins but um, otherwise you know I don't eat a lot of sugar so it, it kind of has that sweet flavor and then these I bought to try something new it's like the generic grape nuts the sugars is three for half a cup three grams which is pretty low and I think the name brand had like four grams per half cup. So I went ahead and got the generic just because. Um, so yeah, I think that's everything. The chili is still cooking. It's pretty close though to being done. I gave it a stir. I'm going to let it settle in a little bit more. I kind of like it to break down and get really yummy. Um, so I will show you um, that in the other video. So talk to you guys soon. Bye.